today we are going to be checking out what I think is the best AA remake or recreation or I don't know. It looks like an upgraded anime adventures to say the least. This game is called Anime Vanguards. Now before I go and show you guys all the sneaks and features this game has to offer, I would appreciate it if you join their Discord server and show your support towards the game. Because I'm not even joking when I said that this game is an upgraded version of AA with all the features I'm about to show you guys. So without further ado, let's go ahead and check out the features Anime Vanguards has to offer. Alright boys, we're gonna check out their sneaks through their YouTube channel. If you guys wanna check them out, you can go to their channel. It's called Kitawari. I've seen some of this, but we're gonna go through them later, syempre. And um, we're just gonna see the trailer for a minute. Let's see. Anyways, I'm probably gonna skip a lot of parts in this video because I just I I'm just reacting to the sneaks itself. But yes, if you wanna see the sneaks yourself, alam na yan, just go to their YouTube channel and uh yes sir. Play this one. Ooh. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at the lobby, boys. This is this wait 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 wait. This was uploaded three weeks ago, March 29. So I don't I don't know if they changed a lot in the lobby already, but it looks similar to anime adventures as you guys can see. The summoning looks nice. Whoa. Bro, this is amazing. Kita niyong nasa taas? Oh my god, bro. Look at this! What the hell? Oh, we're getting Gilgamesh? On release? Huh. Anime Vanguards. Alright. Alright, next clip. Anime Vanguards official gameplay sneak, bro. Yeah, we're seeing a sneak. Ooh, placement is similar to like Anime Adventures, I think. You know, I I have <laughs> Anime Adventures has been dead for like over five months now or six months. I'm not even sure anymore. Oh, what the heck? Kita niyo to. Okay, they they do have their certain uh, way of uh, yung yung art style ng UI. The UI looks different, but it looks clean for me. Ito yung speed wagon. There's like a logo on top of a uh, uh, speed cart. It's like uh, it it uh, tells you that it's a money unit or it's a gold unit. Okay, it is similar to Anime Adventures. The map. Oh my god, bro! It is literally Anime Adventures. The map. But yep, that's the gameplay sneak. Stat reroll sneak. Yan. Yan ang gusto ko makita. Oh my god, the gambling addiction. Yo, I haven't mentioned it yet, pero look at the UI, boys. Unit, store, items, play, area, summon. Profile, battle pass, quest, and codes. Yo, this looks clean. The UI itself, the UI itself, it looks clean. But I'm gonna show you guys later. I say I've seen, I've seen some sneaks where they actually clicked on the UI and they they actually move. The UI moves. Pero dito muna tayo. Stat reroll. Really chill uh, UI. I love that it looks a certain way. I don't know if you guys uh, get what I'm trying to say. It's like uh, they they have their they have their own uh, art style in a way, like the the way the UI goes. But yes, oh my God, looks nice. It looks nice. Looks clean. Now the logo. We we got a sword for the damage. We got um, SPA. I don't know what this is. Looks like a a scratch or a slash. I don't know. And the uh, range is like a, a target, which uh, makes sense. Legendary unit sneaks. Anong Goku to? Goku Kai Kaioken or some subject Grimjo? I don't know who this guy is. Uh, no. I mean, I know. I've seen this guy done sa Bleach, but I, I don't know his name. Gone. Hizaru. The fucking light bullets. Itachi? Oh yeah, Ita Itachi. Was Itachi, ano? Was Itachi like uh, a legendary sa anime adventures? I don't even know. Song Jin Wu sneak. What the hell? Yo. It's gonna be mystic or secret. I haven't mentioned it yet, pero the enemies or the the mobs, it's similar to anime adventures, basically. It still revolves around how this game is like, it's either a remake or an uh, upgraded version of anime adventures. Alright, three, trait re-rolling. Let's go. Alright, so here's the question, boys. We're getting a trait, diba? We're getting our own or the main trait. And then we're, get, we're getting a sub-trait after the main trait. Hmm. 
So it's gonna work similar to ACS, maybe? Hmm, I don't know. We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out more about this game. Alam na yan. I don't know how sub traits work. Like, imagine you get two uniques. And this is what I mean about the UI following a certain way, a certain art style. And their traits. Look at their traits. We're gonna have two traits, a uh, main trait and a sub trait. I don't know how they work. Hopefully, we'll find out when they check their Discord out. Hopefully, they have information. We're gonna focus on the UI, bro. This is the icing. This is the icing of why this game looks. Look at how the UI has an animation. Pag naka hover yung mouse. Like, if you hover your mouse over the UI, it actually moves. I know. Look at that! It's uh, stuff like this that makes you think that the devs actually love the work they put in dito sa anime vanguards. So, we're gonna have calm, rare, epic, and two legendaries. Alright, that's it for UI and summon banner. Alright, let's go and check out the stage selection. So, this is when you go and, um... Select your gameplay or map. I like how they're using actual images for the maps. I, I don't know, bro. I, I I don't know. I mean, it looks cool. Para sa akin. <laughs> There's six acts, players. Oh, we got stories about legend stages. You gotta select the stage on the left side. Um, You select which um, act you're gonna try to beat in the night normal and nightmare mode, and then the players on the left side. And why am I seeing five players? Why am I seeing five players over here, bro? Hmm. Five players. Ooh. Okay. I mean, if they actually do a five player, five player team each time, it would be easier to do the leaderboard runs. Imagine five player LB runs, bro. Yo, that's insane. All right. So what is this? Evolving sneak. All right. This is how you evolve. This is the first time I've seen the uh, the unit CY. Okay, it kind of looks clean para sa akin. They have their certain art style. Like it doesn't look like anime adventures. This this UI right here. Okay, straight to the point. You hover through a unit, you see its damage, SPA and range, not bad. Would be nice if you could like see yung ano, the uh, see if the unit is magic or physical. Wait, 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 wait. wait. If this is a sword that means this guy's physical. Yo, instead of star fruits, they're using essence, colored essence, so like yellow essence stone, uh, pink essence stones, and red essence stones. This is clean. Evolve. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Ngayon ko lang nakita to evolving. Yo, when you view a unit, this is how it looks like. It tells you the unit, mythic. Um, the uh, this is amazing. Like the UI for viewing units. Like attack, SPA, range, you got your stat um, stat underneath your name. And for a person that has mild OCD, this is this is, this looks nice. The traits and sub trait on the left side. Ascensions? Hello? Yo, I feel like they can put something else dito sa right side. Like it could be the the units um could be the units at trait. Or not really trait, it's uh, tawag sa ganun? like a unit if if a unit's a if a unit is melee or magic or whatever. Ano ba tawag doon? Elements? Are, are, I don't even know, bro. It looks nice so far. Unit selling. I don't know why they made the sneak for unit selling, but we're gonna see how the unit selling works. Oh, that's on me. <laughs> they literally become coins. All right. Unit selling. UI looks nice. Alam mo yan. What's, what's next? Ano to? Cosmetic. Cosmetic, bro. On release. This game's gonna get cosmetic and title. Wait, 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 hey, hey, ano to, ah? Profile. This section displays information about the user profile. Playtime, units rolled. Traits, oh my god, bro. Imagine if Anime Adventures had this feature. Wait, 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 cosmetic. Oh, nga pala, cosmetic. Alright, let's see how they, you know. Kasi, no oh my god, boys. Normally on AA, if you wanna equip some, uh, if you wanna equip a certain cosmetic, you have to equip the unit on the first lots of your equip units, basically. And then you're gonna lock the cosmetic, and that's it. Here, on Anime Vanguards, you just click the unit and equip cosmetic. What the hell? You know? So, hello? Unit ascension. Ito palay. Eh. Ito palay. Eh. All right. So nag summon siya. All right. Summon right side ascension. All right. So. He has a zero ascension Naruto. Nice. 
or she I, I don't know sino ba si Yoro is Yoro Kat yeah we're just gonna assume everyone's a bro everyone's a bro bro two Naruto's you only need one for the first ascension now you need two for another ascension I assume you need three for the third ascension yep so what does ascension what does it do oh I love the animation for the stars kita niyo ba bro look at it oh my god it's an eye candy right there it looks well polished ilang naman tayo gusto ko eh that's the only thing I, I need in a tower defense game or any or in any roblox game it's just it has to be polished oh the battle pass I haven't seen this yet to play it through it looks nice free pass obviously you get gems coins maybe one one reroll or two rerolls and then of course premium passes how much is this though 500 700 robux all right here we go boys unit ascensions unit ascension allows you to ascend a unit to increase their statistics by sacrificing additional copies of the same unit now this is what i mean about the uh, replayability because in anime adventures as soon as you get a duplicate uh, mythic units they become food so basically they're, they're they're useless so dito the ascension system basically changes the the uses for duplicates because you're gonna have to like use them for ascending certain units diba? we're adding confirmation to important actions like trait rerolling Yo! bro oh my god yes oh my god yo yo if you guys didn't know i actually rolled off unique once bro once and it sucks could have been prevented if the if anime adventures has added this system all right so nagri reroll siya ethereal okay that's a mythic it's conf it's asking you to confirm if you want to roll off your mythic trait uh auto click boom all right the question of mythic you got another ethereal bro three percent that is amazing that is amazing imagine you had like 1000 rerolls and then gusto mong mabilisan, you know, just, you just, you know, you just, you just wanna speed run this shit, bro. Yo, this is amazing, bro. Let's go. I love this shit. If this video haven't convinced you to check out Anime Vanguards, you're missing out. You're missing out. And I'll see you guys later. Let's go. The game is set to release next month on May 5. Now, with all the sneaks we've seen so far, I think the game is pretty polished at this point. But, of course, they're still adding a lot more stuff in the game. So, May 5, May 5, next month, or somewhere near that day. Expect it. Let's go. Let's play it. Tarana.